Being one of the dominant music streaming services worldwide with hundreds of millions of users, Spotify has managed to keep a broad reach by providing an interface across multiple platforms while maintaining a library of 50 million tracks. In the course of exploring, you may have gotten a few artists that you don't want on your recently played page. You can remove these artists fairly easy, but you might have gotten a little lost while looking for the option. Settings you control on Spotify differ slightly between web player, desktop, and mobile app. Without further ado, here's how and where to do it. To start, you'll have to be on Spotify's desktop app. If you just want to keep others from seeing your recently played artists, click the arrow icon next to your username and select Settings. From here, scroll down until you get to the Social section of your Settings menu and toggle off Show My Recently Played Artist. This should instantly hide the section from your profile. If you want to clear them out from your recently played page, just navigate to the playlist using the menu on the left. From here, hover over an artist you want to remove, click on the triple dotted icon that appears, and click on Remove from Recently Played. The artist should be removed from the list instantly, though do note that it may take some time for it to disappear from your Spotify's homepage. To prevent new artists from showing up on your recently played page, you can start a private listening session on both the desktop and mobile app. To do this on your desktop, click the arrow icon next to your username and select Private Session. A blue padlock icon should show up on the top of your profile image to notify you that your current session is private. If you're on the mobile app, tap the gear icon on the top of the page to access your settings menu. From here, scroll down to the social section and toggle on private session. There'll be no visual reminder to remind you that you're currently on private session. Note, private sessions automatically end once you restart Spotify or after a long period of inactivity. If you like this guide, make sure to subscribe for all sorts of videos covering Spotify and other technology. And don't forget to check out one of these videos we think you might enjoy.